Well, we talked to some parents who are very concerned because they have sick children who are coughing, but they cannot get a test. Now, we are at San Joaquin General Hospital where they have drive through testing, but you must have an appointment. Testing by appointment and physician order only. Signs posted outside of San Joaquin General Hospital telling people who have an appointment where to go. But not everyone is able to get an appointment and get tested for coronavirus. I've been to Kaiser every day since Monday, including one trip to the emergency room. A mother we talked with who did not want to reveal her identity has been taking her six-year-old daughter to the doctor every day because she keeps getting worse. They are saying that it is COVID-19, but they can't test her for it because the testing is limited and only available to the elderly or patients that are high risk at this point. And her husband has symptoms as well, but cannot get a test. At first, his doctor was determined to get him one, but the infectious disease department at Kaiser turned it down. San Joaquin County Public Health says those who can be tested have to have an order from a physician. When the physician places the order to do the test, then that's when that process starts. So they would either reach out to the public health department. Guidelines from CDC include a high fever and symptoms such as cough or shortness of breath. The real uh, idea is to ensure uh, testing for patients that are symptomatic and quickly identify them and um, be able to quickly get that information to public health and be able to isolate that individual. And Dr. Elias Parser from San Joaquin County General Hospital says there is strict criteria and if you have a fever, you should self-isolate. I haven't seen my wife and kids for two weeks. I'm staying in a different place in the home so that in case I do get exposed, when I go up and see patients that have COVID positive, that I don't expose them and therefore they don't expose people in my community. He says following guidelines now could save lives. This is a pandemic, it's real, and we need to really make sure that we follow the guidelines that the state is putting out there. In French Camp, Melinda Meza, KCRA 3 News.